Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. How are you doing today? As as for me, I'm good and I would like to share another video of JD Social Studies budget plan and practice test for being quick to think and get the right answers. So let's get started. Here I made a pie for just easy example for the test and in my first question here based on this pie if your one year income is thirty thousand dollars how much dollars do you spend on transportations so here's this transportation percent it's 12.50 percent transportation so how to get and here's the answer the answer is letter c three thousand seven hundred and fifty dollars so here's the solution thirty thousand dollars times Point twelve fifty twelve hundred and fifty. It's like as always when you translate the percent to point you just move two numbers to the left. So let's say the percent is here, so let's just one one two and put the point here to do that times. So the answer is letter C three thousand seven hundred and fifty dollars so let's get to the second questions here is still based on this pie chart if your one year income is thirty thousand dollars and you spend eleven thousand dollars on housing and healthcare how much dollar do you have left for savings so here in the block color there is thirty seven point fifty percent so if you spend uh, eleven hundred eleven thousand dollars in housing and health care uh, there is a little leftover for savings so here we have to get the answer the answer is letter B is 250 and how did you get the 250 dollars here's the solution thirty thousand dollars times point thirty seven fifty equals eleven thousand two hundred fifty and minus the eleven thousand dollars here and equals to $250. So you still have $250 left for savings. So let's go to the third question. Based on this pie chart, if your one year income is $30,000, if you spend $3,750 on food, how much dollars do you spend on clothing? So let's, let's go get it. So here's, uh, you spend on food including that's the that's the question so the answer is three thousand seven hundred and fifty so that's how you spend including oh the question is confusing on food so here's how, okay, now I'm confused in my own example. So here's the solution. $30,000 times uh, 0.25% equals $7,500. So here is 25%. So that's why you times it to 0.25. So the answer is uh, 7500 dollars divided by two so the answer is three thousand seven hundred and fifty so let's get to the fourth question the fourth question is based on this pie chart if your one year income is thirty thousand dollars how much dollar do you spend on school expenses food including combined so you will combine the school expenses and food including this uh, this is the easiest questions of the five questions that I have here so I think I don't need to have a solution just think about it 25% plus 25% is 50% so how much the 50% of $30,000 so the answer is you got it $15,000 that's easy you don't need to have a solution just think about it and then let's go to the last question my fifth question is 
based on this pie chart, if your one-year income is $30,000, if the school tuition is 20%, how much dollar do you spend on school supply and books? So, here's, this, here's the school expenses. It's 25%. So how do you how do we get the answer? The answer is uh, 1,500. The solution is 30,000 times 20% equals 6,000, and 30,000 times 25% it's 700 7,500 dollars. So you'll say 700 7,500 minus 6,000 dollars equals 1,500. So that's how you get it. So 20%. 25%. So that's all for today, guys. My easy example for today. Hope you guys have a fun Sunday. Thank you guys for watching. Subscribe, like, share, and comments below if you can. Or you can suggest what video you do you like me to upload next. I'm, I am still working on the essay. It's the hardest thing for me to do. But hopefully I, will, I can do it. So, I will see you guys in my next video. You have a wonderful day. Take care and bye.